Ladies, 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 ladies. We are here on the shield. And we are here on the shield to review SmackDown from July 17th, 2020. And it was trash. Uh, these ratings are just going to get worse and worse. You have MLB, NBA come back, NFL, possibly maybe even college football. The ratings are going to be, they're, they're in trouble. WWE's in trouble. And they, they have nobody else to blame but themselves for keeping, keep from, just keep doing these shows. They they, they have nobody to blame but themselves at this point. I mean, who else can you blame? Like, you can't blame the wrestlers or anybody else. You have to blame yourself. And these shows are just not, they're just not good. Okay, so we're just going to start off. Cesaro and Nakamura on. I was just say Cesaro defeated Big E. I put I thought it was a tag match, but Cesaro defeated uh, Big E. It was a solid match. I mean, it was a good match. I mean, Cesaro's an underrated wrestler. I'd like to see Cesaro and Big E separate singles wrestlers. I mean, it was a solid match. Cesaro's an underrated wrestler. He should get a bigger push. So it's a tables match. What a shock. So we get a tag team title table match at Extreme Rules. Wow. You had a moment of bliss segment. Oh my god! And it wasn't good until we until I saw Sasha out there, and Sasha and Bailey out there, and then and then the special guest mystery was Oscar. Like that was a shit. That was shit. And then they and then we had a brawl. Then we had Bailey and Sasha defeat Oscar and Nikki Cross. That was actually a solid match. That was solid. Well, the first, like, first, like, few matches, tag matches, I mean, they were okay. They wasn't the greatest, but they were solid enough. And you had the Firefly Funhouse segment with Bray Wyatt. You had Braun Strowman, like, uh, uh, I'm the monster among men. Like, who cares? Cutting a promo? Terrible. Like, I don't care about Braun Strowman cutting a promo. It was terrible. Uh, you bet, you couldn't even understand what he, what the hell he was saying. And then he and then it was a squash match. Braun Strowman defeating John Morrison squash match. What? You have Lacey Evans defeating Naomi. God, it's just god awful. I mean, why do I even why do we even watch this? I mean, I only watch it to review it for content. On YouTube. And yeah, AJ Styles defeat Matt Riddle. That was a good main event. It's just a shitty ass finish with a fruit roll up. Of, of just a, a roll up. You can't use the Styles Clasher. Or at least a phenomenal elbow. Use a fucking fruit roll up. So I'm giving SmackDown a C minus. Terrible, terrible shield. So AJ Styles retained the belt. It wasn't a good show. I thought it was not that really that good. I'm not surprised. The main event was good. I like the Sasha Bailey tag match, and that was about it. And the new and the Big E Cesaro match. So. That's all I'll see you next time. I'll go out. Holla at you, boy.